This is New Year's Eve in my country. In the next couple of hours, in Laughter Republic, we will be celebrating the new year. May I take this opportunity to address half a million of my followers on this platform. Happy New Year to every one of you. I hope you had a good Christmas. Your governments will tell you how they have had a momentous year. Point of correction. A great year. But it has been a great year for them, not for their citizens, not for the people who elected them, but a great year for them. Depending on where you are around the world, the economy of your country should be growing. Infl inflation should be reducing. Tax cuts for the poor should be implemented by your respective governments. Investments to take people out of poverty in your respective countries should have happened. They will tell you, and when I say they, your respective governments will tell you as part of their reflections of the year that they are driving forward improvements for you. They will tell you what they are trying to do to reduce cost of living. The fact of the matter is cost of living should be reducing around the world. They will tell you why it is necessary to go to wars to protect so-called democracy that does not work, that they don't even believe in and does not benefit the people. They should be supporting businesses in your respective countries, not making things difficult for you. And they should be creating jobs for youths, not make up figures. If they are not doing any of this wherever you are located and they have not been able to do any of this in 2023, at the next election in your respective countries, boot them out, kick them out through the ballot box. You deserve better. You deserve a brighter future. And I will do what I can on this platform to continue to raise awareness of the things you need to look out for when your leaders tell you lies. I want to use this opportunity to wish you a happy new year in 2024. Open your eyes. Don't be deceived. 2024 is the year when you should remove incompetent leaders in your respective countries.